Hello guys, Mr. Dandamon2050 here, welcome to another video, and in today's video guys I'm going to be showing you how to move your Origin games to another folder, or in your case you might want to be moving your games to another drive. Now just in my scenario guys, as you can see, my SSD has 54 gig left, while my, while my hard drive for example has 736 gig. Now in today's video guys I'm going to be showing you how to move your games from one drive to another. In my case I'm going to be moving my games from my C drive to my D drive. Now. Um, so the first thing you want to do is open Origin. So you just want to find Origin and click on it. And once it loads up, um, here we are. Let's open it from the bottom there. Ah, come on, Origin. There we are. So this is Origin. Now, in my scenario, I want to move SimCity to my D drive because I don't play the game that often. And I think, you know, while it take up, um, you know, the amount of gigs it does on my SSD when I don't use it. So, this game is what I want to move to my D drive. Now, you want to click on Origin at the top and click on Application Settings. Then you want to go to the Advanced tab. And you see here where it says your games will be installed to the following location. By default, it's on the C drive, Programmers Files, uh, x86, and it's in the Origin Games folder. Now, you want to click Change on here. This is if you want it to be changed permanently. So in my case, I'm going to be going to the the D drive, creating a folder called Origin Games. So just type it in there, Origin Games. Click Enter, and then click Select Folder. So from now on, it'll install it there. And yeah, you will get a pop-up saying games you previously installed will not be moved. And that's what I'm going to be showing you today. So from now on, the install on the D drive. This one here, the game installers, don't worry about that, to be honest. When you install the game, the installer goes there. Once the game is finished, it'll yeah, be deployed on the D drive and then it'll just wipe the ones on the C, so forget about that. So now that we've changed this to the D drive, you want to close Origin and make sure you close it via the bottom there, so click Exit. So there we are, once it's disappeared, there we are. So in my scenario, my SimCity is on the C drive, so I want to go to the Program Files, I want to go to the Origin, Origin Games folder, and SimCity. Now this is 3.24 gig, so I'm going to right click on this, click cut and then I'm going to move it I'm going to move it to my D drive I'm going to go to um, what do I call it? Uh, Origin Games I'm going to right click and click paste so my Origin um, SimCity game is now going to um, the Origin Games folder on the D drive and uh, once this is done this isn't too slow to be honest comparing I'm writing to a hard drive this is not a bad speed at all 150 3 megabyte per second. So just going to wait for this. I'll pump the cutting the video here. So nearly done. So there we are. So yeah, that's that's all done. So now SimCity is now on here. And as you can see, it's in that folder all all, all of the 3.24 gig. So I'm going to reopen Origin. And now I'll show you what happens. So this is the magic bit, I suppose. So once it opens, what? That's small. <laughs> so once it opens here, look, you want to go to the My Games. And you click on SimCity, and you see it'll say download. Now, just click the download button, click the yes button there, and you'll see what it'll do now is that I actually recognize. So, just confirm your language to flat. Yep, click yes, 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 yes. So, it's saying that it's going to take 12 gig. Just click download all this nonsense that you get. And you see, look, it'll skip it forward because it'll realize that it's on the D drive. It'll say installing because it's got to install again, kind of. And uh, yeah, that'll eliminate the fact that you've got to re-download because I hate downloading games again and again uh, if I've already downloaded it because fair enough, I do have fiber optics but at the end of the day, you're waiting for something to download, that's depressing. So this is the way to eliminate that guys and this is how you can move a game from one drive to another. Anyway guys, this, if this video has helped you out, please feel free to look at, at the actual Steam guide I did for this. So if you want to um, move your Steam games to another folder, there'll be a link on the screen for that now. And uh, yeah, apart from that guys, thanks, thanks for watching, I hope this has helped you out. Feel free to like, comment and also subscribe. In a bit guys, goodbye.